Coming to you from the Rocky Mountain Super Chair here at Breckenridge Resort, you're watching SnowReportTV.com. It's February 16th, 2011 here at Breckenridge. My name's Pete, you're watching SnowReportTV.com and we are in the middle of the Colorado Rockies and we've got our fingers crossed because guess what? There is snow on the way. How much snow? We have no idea. We've got forecast models anywhere from very dry to an inch up to maybe about half a foot and I've even seen some forecasters saying a foot of snow. I think the San Juans in southern Colorado are going to fare a little bit better out of this storm but we'll see what happens. You never know with this type of weather. weather. It is very unpredictable. And the good news for Tahoe people is that already the snow's flying. They're six inches as of this morning. And I looked at the forecast models. Man, there could be one to two feet falling over the next few days there. Look out for some powder days. Not only that, very cold conditions which means it won't be heavy snow, it'll be nice, light and dry. Here at Breckenridge today, conditions, well let's be honest, they're not fantastic compared to what we've had. A day on the slopes is always better than a day in the office anyway, so we're having a great time. But it is a little bit slick underneath on the groomers, and that powder is very hard packed up top and can be quite slick. I wouldn't recommend if you're an intermediate heading into some of the more difficult terrain. Hey friends, this is Lars from Washington DC. My run of the day today is Dukes here at Breckenridge. You get to the top of the Rocky Mountain chair, stay to your skiers left, and when you get down here, check out the moguls off to your left. It's a great day for skiing and a great run. In fact, let's try it out. Let me tell you one thing about a day like today is the lack of crowds. There is no one around, no lift lines, even here at Breckenridge, which is a great thing. And it's still a lot of fun to cruise around with your friends. So keep an eye out for that falling snow over the next few days. We've got our fingers crossed. We really need to freshen up this cover. You can see the damage that the warm temperatures has done over the last few days, despite the fact the base still 130% or more of average for this time of year. There's a lot of snow here at Breckenridge and a lot of snow across Colorado. Remember Remember to like us on Facebook, comment on this episode, share it with your friends. We love that. My name's Pete on SnowReportTV.com and I will see you on the mountain.